for the sake of our matrimony, I asked if you can solve that issue so that we can decide to focus on one another. So I thought. But up until recently, I realized you've been lying to me. My decision is not to continue this marriage, as I realized and got confirmation that you've, been, you've never been fully invested in our relationship. Without revealing too much of the details, I've discovered you're still talking to the man that you were speaking to on the first night we got married. I have the screenshots, and in those said screenshots, you're begging this man to express his love for you. There's been a pattern of things that she's been doing. And when I asked her about it, she wasn't truthful about it. So I just needed to make sure what the and ends are alive. The way I tell her, I'm going to tell her. You literally have a ghost account. You pretend to be another woman counseling him what he has to do to win your heart back. Why would you even do such a thing when you have a fresh wedding ring on your hand? Advising another man to fight for your love, Kumo. While we lay and share a bed with one another, that's very far. Very, very far. Furthermore, you even went to the extent of making sure that you are the woman the man is heartbroken about. That's the ultimate betrayal that I've ever felt ever in my life, as that confirms that you've never been fully committed to this matrimony, and I've given you multiple opportunities to come clean. Until recently, you've came clean, but with not the full truth. She was trying to build a safety net in case doesn't fly with her and I, we don't continue. She has something to fall back on, which I thought was very selfish and... In saying all of that, I will offer my grace to you. And maybe you are young and misguided or not ready to commit or you are insecure about what brought us together. But more than anything, I'm extremely disappointed and hurt, but I won't hold it against you, as you probably have your own reasons. I just wish you were as honest with me as I was with you. From your dearly beloved ex-husband.